expect to of Donald Trump for president. Uh, and no, I'm not voting for Donald Trump. But this is talking about something that he said, which is term limits, and that I'm very interested in. Uh, so, okay, so Hillary, and this is part two, Hillary is a part of, uh, uh, let's get this straight, for one, the seven large families run America. They don't run America, they run the world. They're the ones who crashed the bank. When George Bush uh, made up the whole story about Al-Qaeda, him and Dick Cheney, they they weren't the masterminds behind that. You got the Bilderberg, the DuPonts, you got the Rothschilds, I mean, you got the largest families. They're all Jewish people. I've mentioned this before. They're Jewish people. The Russian Eskazians, who are a warlike race, who continually put us in war. You gotta understand, we've been at war for over 200 years. Why? Because the Jewish people run the world pretty much when it comes to the banking system. So they always have us at war with someone. This is why ISIS has, okay, to bring it back around. This is why Donald Trump keeps blaming Hillary for ISIS. It's because she is the Secretary of Defense. She helped implement uh, ISIS. He's saying you made up ISIS. A lot of people are going, Hillary did make up ISIS. Wrong. Hillary did have a lot to do with ISIS because there's a documentary that shows that ISIS, a lot of their guns, a lot of their stuff that they have, we gave them. Uh, we gave them that. We left them our military equipment. You, 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 seen, you seen Iron Man when Tony Stark got upset because... You know, a lot of soldiers were getting blown up by stuff that he made. Well, that is actually true. Uh, except it's our government. We're the ones who gave ISIS all of their firepower. We gave them vehicles, keys, gassed up, everything. Why? Because we need a war to fight. Why? Because the Russian Eskazians, who are the Jewish people, need us to be at war because war is profit. Okay? If you don't believe it, go look at what happened during the Black Plague and what, what the Jews were doing. Excuse me, what the Jew-ish were doing. There's a difference between the Jews and the Jew-ish. Anyway, so Hillary Clinton is just a puppet anyway, but she is a major figure when it comes to being a puppet. She's crooked as hell and she is a killer. Literally, trust and believe that. Uh, so this is one reason why Donald Trump is like, look, I want to get those people out of office. I want to implement term limits. I want to make it so uh, no one who has been in office can run and be lobbyists. Why? Because they're just going to lobby for the same thing. And we're going to be in the same position over and over and over again. Look, Donald, I get that. Too bad you're the biggest asshole on the planet, but I am for that 100%. You know, it's too bad Donald Trump hates everyone because what he said made perfect sense. Like, I would get people who are, who have been in the system, I would give them term limits and get their asses out of there because they're the ones who's killing our soldiers. And then they want us to have all this pride in America. Listen, I was a soldier before. I had pride in serving my family, you know, as a soldier. I figured that I was protecting my family. But you know, when you step back and you really look at what's going on in the military, you realize that we're just hiring guns. We're just mercenaries over there killing innocent people. How many people have we killed looking for El freaking Qaeda? And all that other nonsense and El Qaeda was part of the CIA. They were built by the CIA. We gave El Qaeda their weapons so they could fight in the mountains of Kabul. Kabul. We're the one who supplied the Bin Ladens with weapons. You know what I mean? So it just doesn't make sense. Let's see. All right, I'm gonna have to do a part three on this. Boy, tone to a two. Get to check on my music just right there.